Okay, this is the outer half of the Irving's business district, in a sense. Um, that, this is a rest, the restaurant I'm pointing at is where my yeah yeah and my parents and I used to eat there, like, um, a lot more frequently when I was in college and sometimes high school, but that was no longer, like, our priority because, like, um, the, I find the, the Ocean Avenue one, like, quality a bit better, like, a lot, and, yeah, so I, and also the same here is, we don't go there a lot, <laughs> I wish, but I don't know, it's sort of like, eh, <laughs> it was more like an eh, but it was the same, but this is a restaurant that, there's so many transitions. I'm not even kidding. It was like a Hong Kong seafood restaurant. Then it was turned into some, uh, like, a ramen shop. And then it turns into this. There's, like, so many transitions. It's not even funny. <laughs> like, come on, man. I was laughing my butt off when I see business transitions. Like, like from, like, a Chinese restaurant to, like, a Japanese. And now this. Like, I'm like, come on, dude. I was just like, I'm laughing so hard. Oh yeah, this is a fall noodle house I've been talking about. Yeah, that was like good, good, good stuff. Good stuff. Um, I wonder if this is the, oh yeah, that. It was like a Vietnamese um, restaurant. It, yeah, it, it, it sort of is. It's more like a, it's sort of like a French Vietnamese restaurant, some kind of, oh my goodness. They're having a Vietnamese French restaurant of some sort of vibe. I kind of assumed that. Uh, this one that used to be way more common years, I mean, this one like, used to be vibrant years, but that one has been vacant for so long. I don't even remember that anymore. It's been, it's been vacant for so long that it's even funny. <laughs> What's even more like, weird that um, this corner area um, I'm to get, this one used to be a a, a laundry mat at uh, the corner years ago and then it turned into like a cricket <laughs> like there's just like we, this is selling cell phones like random smartphones <laughs> I have a clam phone for this and this one used to be a KFC that's at a barber shop it's kind of funny. And I, funny thing is, I did met my teacher, Miss Garibaldi, from like, like, like around the time I was in high school. <laughs> That's been really years. The last time I ate there was like, um, I was gonna pick up some snacks in college, <laughs> which is funny. And ironically, it was shut down because I don't know what happened. <laughs> Nobody come there anymore? Yeah, mostly nobody come there anymore. It's uh, okay, it's okay. And there's like several transition, business transitions. And there were like a lot of them. It, it started to become more Asian, Chinese, Asian kind of style. Like, man, there's a lot of styles that were Asian style. Like more of a, the, the way it was meant for that, that, um, for this community, yeah. And there's like deep palms, but I think it just, oh, look at this, like, yeah, this is some um, weird stuff, like deep palms, not, no, no pun intended, oh, pun intended, this is tea palms. <laughs> and there's like some areas, I, I think that uh, I would say something about my mom's business, yeah, that's the one my mom used to work at, and it was kind of, it was cool. I. I went there a lot when I was younger, a kid. Um, not anymore, because, um, you know, different for business decisions and stuff. I don't. Want to, I won't talk about that one anymore. But Shanky, I my parents would usually buy this. Besides uh, any other bakery shops, my parents would just buy from Clement. This one is also one of the most like second frequent things. That was kind of fun. Fun, 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 fun. So, about my mom's bank. That was the Bank of Orient. That was like, started like, um, what, half a century ago to serve Chinese and American communities and stuff like that. And it's, it's branched off. Long story short, it went 
to Hawaii and China, so that's kind of good. Interesting story to behold. It's a private bank company, but it was a good bank company. I went there a couple picnic events with my moms, like, and their stuff. But I met them, so cool. But I won't name them. It's not cool. Shall be nameless, but it's kind of cool. So there's like real estate area, and there's like, and here's the sign that I got. It was like memories that start flowing back to me. Like there's some, unfortunately, there's a lot of colorful types, like very sketchy, like icky people. Oh my goodness! Like, this is the one that I got. I got, but I got one from Chinatown. The glasses I'm wearing now, I got from Chinatown. The one is like, it wasn't that. It wasn't that good as it used to, but yeah, there's some issues with, there's like vacancy area and it's like where it's sort of like attracting more vocal bands. So that's, man, yeah, it's the police. So if I ever like got into trouble, I'll just be at the police, like standing right here, it's like calling for help. <laughs> kind of cool. Smart, but kind of dumb for me. So this is the Walgreens, but I used to go there sometimes. Not really. But, um. Hi. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. So they had this extension years ago. I was going to do that video, but for college reasons and personal reasons and combinations of like not having to deal with the traffic the afternoon traffic and shit i just don't want to do with that this is more like the chinese steam it's a sort of like for seniors design ironically and i like this because of the market but it was it was cool that to see it and it's like oh it's it's you know it's really funny i there's like quickly is the only one that's still, still there it was like it was standing it was existed like when i was in middle school <laughs> and it's still there i'm i'm shocked most of the restaurants are still there I'm, I'm, and including that salon area so i'm shocked so shocked <laughs> i'm 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 like speechless i'm, I'm sorry i'm that speechless and okay so it's like a Wing Chun, Cole, and the other stuff. It's kind of interesting. But that's not important anymore. Well, actually, we did come in once in a while. And this one, that used to be a traveling agency thing with like all sorts of random things, like Lo Fuji books. Like, I was thinking about like making a video episode of Lo Fuji when I my main channel, but this is a personal one, so I won't talk about it anymore. <laughs> It's kind of interesting. Um, I have a lot of memories, like going there and just buying little Fuji books, and it's, it's kind of interesting. Look at it. It's look at it. it's it, it has, um it's urgent care for like people, and um, I won't talk about it because like there's issues like marijuana like areas like <laughs> a lot of shit have going on and behind the scenes that I won't talk about. And this is the one that my parents my mom would buy for like, because it was so good. The Vietnamese sandwiches are so good. Um, I have many, 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 many Vietnamese sandwiches, Dalai sandwiches, it was kind of good. It's good. I, I, I can't say, I can't agree any more than this. IT, this one, I know the boba shops are getting more frequent uh, as more time passes. I'm getting, I'm getting um, a lot of years have passed. I'm starting to forget. <laughs> and I. I have memories of blockbusters and round table but all those years. I, I'm just babbling an idiot. I'm sorry. I go there with my friends, Roger. And, whoops. Sorry, Roger. I'm going to use your name. Like, So me and my friend, Roger, we went there to, the, to that restaurant. It was like a, it was that restaurant that's still there. Thank God it was still there. And I love doing there. You know, like, um, it, it was like we buy chicken and we buy some like rice noodles and some other stuff. 
and there's like fresh and, and I, oh, it was still there. Thank God it was still there. We were like, we're just talking about random stuff and we would just, we just go to quick leads and get some drinks or some, or some other things like that when we have time. When we have more time in City College, by the way, not anymore because we had work. And when you have work, you're busy, so. Um, there's a Vietnamese restaurant. Lowe's, I tried that before, it was good. That's all I'm saying. That was all I'm saying, it was good. But anyway, I wanted to try this again, but I don't know. <laughs> so, um, okay, thank God it, there's nobody here. Um, so, <laughs> sorry, I was just like trying to yank my dog around a little bit. And this is a ramen restaurant I actually like. It's very good. And also the, the green tea thing. It was also good. I also like that other Bobush tea shops. It was more one of the more recent tea shops that my friends and, and I went there. It was good. And Happy Bakery, yeah, 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 that one. That was really good. It was so good. But <laughs> I I think like my parents didn't want that style, so it's like, yeah, I understand that. I have good memories. I have memories in college and high school and all that other stuff, but yeah, it's everything in between. Oh, shit. Come on, Come on Candy. Move your... There's, um... Yeah, there's a Chinese writing there. I mean, this might be good, but there's a lot of... There's a lot of times like, I would see it and I was like, oh my god, homeless people sleeping. It's not really good business. It's not good business. This one is it's cat the bakery shop. It was pretty pretty good by the way. And this one I I don't go there a lot, but I did with my parents my mom and I did buy that piano book one time, so that was good. Pretty good by the way. Um, okay, so we would just like um, this is um one area I this is the one I was gonna talk about. Blockbusters and round table pizza. But first I'll just go past to that area. Cafes and all. I'll just say ignore the little things. So round table pizza right next to that restaurant I went there. <laughs> that restaurant was good. I actually would go there but it's it's Chinese Vietnamese restaurant but it was really good. <laughs> it was written in Vietnamese. <laughs> you can just go there. I like that it was good, good stuff. So, but this one is, this one brings back a lot of memories. A long time ago, my, my parents, my, my mom and my sister, my little sister and I, we went to this round table pizza, right? So, um, we would go there and, and there's like arcade games. Yeah, you know, like NCK games and there's like, um, Neo Geo arcade games and like a shooting where you just like shoot ducks, shoot deers and shit. Like it was fun. It was really good memories. But um, a lot of time passed and people just don't go around table pizza anymore. And I don't think people have closed down, long story short. And this is a seven. <laughs> it's like you're selling kitchenware, good for lives, cosmetics and stuff like that. So that's a lot of things. And that's a long story short. I'll make it sorry long, long, long story short. Um, this is the stuff that they were selling these days. It's it's like a long business standpoint. It's very good. It's good for them because people are buying housewares and and cosmetics from anywhere that you might not get it from online stores and like the mainstream shopping area. So that was pretty good. It's like a mom and pop shop that was kind of like that, yeah. Um, this one shut down. It was funny. It got shut down years ago. Hey, I don't even remember how long that's been. But well, this one, this is a good, a good well, it used to be Blockbusters, funny enough. I went there back in high school, but I never really had enough memories because 
the blockbusters when I was in high school came at a time. I think that was Netflix. They were just transitioning from just selling you like DVD, uh, delivering you DVDs to like going full on streaming. That's pretty much it. That's a long story short. Long story short, Blockbuster didn't survive and died. Just like GameStop is going to right now, which is funny. <sighs> Blockbusters, miss you. Long live, um, goodwill. Blockbusters, I miss you. So, Jane Fu, Jane Ting Call, that one's pretty good. I don't really go there that much, but we would just like <laughs> come there sometimes. And Sunset Super, it's a pretty good supermarket, but I not the reason why like this I this why people are didn't want like camp people with cameras in there because for business reasons multiple layers of business reasons people don't want like at the business at the supermarket and the fresh one especially when there's like very sensitive fresh and raw materials people don't want like people at the at this era do not like like get in trouble with the like with multiple multiple um agencies like the feds the police the internet and all that stuff People don't want to. People don't want to deal with that crap, <laughs> like legal ramifications. That's what. Long story short, that's why. Like, <laughs> it's sort of like, <laughs> like why. That's more like actually. That's more like why they don't want you dealing. Like they don't want you carrying a camera when there's like there's already security cameras up there that can watch you. They're like, oh, can we can look wild. Well, memories and stuff like yeah. Um. Let me see that. So there's like a part-time and full-time cashiers. They come inside and apply, and this is, um, <laughs> they're now hiring. So they're now hiring janitor, produce, and I would just walk in interview and it'll call. <laughs> it's like, hey, this like old style kind of, and you walk in an interview or just make an appointment and say, hey, I'm interested in doing janitor or produce and I was like, I would go there like if I would I don't have a job right now. I was like, it's like, cool. This is um sort of style that Yeah. You know, I think this is the last area and I would just like end this video right now. Because um it just this is the one that we my parents and I like my my parents used to come a little bit, but not all the time because Clement, like I said, Clement has like more like interesting stuff going, just, uh, like just as much. But it just um, the quality of the materials were were similar. I I'm not gonna say it, but it's just a personal opinion. My parents would say they say it was oh it's. It's oh, it's the quality, I mean, and, and they have more 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 varieties, and then not here, and and then I come here, and it has more memories as well. Um, so uh, I'm not my I'm, I, my parent, both me and my parents are right about this area in Clement. It just mem more memories here, and and you know it's funny that used that wasn't there like half a century ago. <laughs> the Chinese signs and all that, that wasn't there. It was like, I would assume somebody like, like got inspired by Hong Kong's old deco, like the neon, the neon um, writings and the fonts and they did this. <laughs> it's kind of interesting, it's fun. <laughs> I don't know, it's like a, my head noggin right there. It, it, it's sort of like, I'm assuming things like, um, <laughs> it was kind of funny. Yeah, yeah. It, I, w I would go there, but it's the pay. I'm, I don't really care about the pay. I just want that job. <laughs> but my job, my current job, like part-time job is fine, but I, eventually I would have to go find something else to do. <laughs> and it's just like be like, I don't know, caster or janitor or produce. Like, I don't know. It's kind of interesting. I would just make old school. Mm. Cool, cool. Um, so this area, I think, like, this, this other area like Vicente, but this one is, like, 
It looks, look at that, look at that. <laughs> this is half a century old, that, that number, that font. That was so cool. <laughs> I never thought it was that. They have this, a lot of layers of Chinese stuff in there too, but I won't go in there, but like I said, business reasons. They, it's very sensitive, like, stuff. <laughs> like, to put it lightly, I, I'm not even going that far, as I'd say. I'm not kidding. People don't want you with these cameras on exposing them. Like, <laughs> yeah. And so I can understand business decisions. Like, people, like, in their business, like, don't want that kind of stuff. <laughs> it's like, that's not the, the drama that they don't want to deal with. They want this people come and not and just do their own business they don't want to deal with that crap <laughs> it's not good it's good and the cards um that was good i i i don't mind i don't mind that anyway it's good so i think i'm gonna end this video <laughs> it's a uh, good memories um good memories of irving and noriega and by the way <laughs> it's just this is the second episode i just i'm gonna end this video i'm sorry i was being um taking too long i'm gonna end the video and um thank you for my my 20 plus video like minute it's just um i appreciate it and i'll just um i'll say have a good night i mean good morning and my birthday time yay